What's up you guys, it's Ashley and welcome back to my channel. So today, obviously you guys read the title, you know what's going on. I thought I'd kick off 2019 with a get to know me tag. I posted a few videos now and you know, you guys kind of got to know a little bit about me in my very first video, but um, not enough. I don't think so I thought that I would do the get to know me tag so it has a few more questions well a lot more questions um, uh, with a few more things I can answer for you guys also like background switch up is temporary I am back at home for Christmas break so I'm in my old room that doesn't look like my old room because it's kind of been transformed into like a guest room but I'm a guest whatever Question number one, where did you grow up? So I grew up in Belleville, Illinois. I used to live, well a lot of people don't know what that is or where that is. When people think of Illinois, they tend to think of, I keep looking in the viewfinder, I'm sorry, I'm gonna try to look here. Um, people think of Illinois, they think of Chicago, which is up north. Um, I live in Southern Illinois, so I'm actually closer to Missouri than I am to Chicago. Um, but I grew up on, I used to live on the east end of Belleville, now I live on the west end of Belleville. And I've lived on the west end basically the majority of my life, so that's where I grew up. Okay, uh, where do you currently live? I currently live in, uh, I was gonna say Belleville, Illinois. I currently live in Columbia, Missouri because that is where I attend school. Um, so yeah. Who, but obviously when I come home, I come home to Belleville. Um, who is your first best friend? Hmm, my first best friend, very first one. My very first best friend was actually my neighbor. Well, she lived across the street and her name was Vanya. I would go to her house like every single day or she would come to my house, like we would eat dinner at each other's houses. Um, we obviously played outside together. We would play with Barbie dolls and like, this big Barbie dream house that she had but then when I was in I am so out of breath <laughs> that's terrible um when I was in the first no when I was in kindergarten um her family decided that they were going to basically like um travel the world in an RV so they ended up moving unfortunately and I was really 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 sad um, for a long time um, and when they moved she ended up giving me like her big Barbie dream house and that was like my memory of her and I kept it for so long like even when I was too too old to even be playing with Barbies I still had it but I ended up giving it away um, but Vanya if you're out there hey girl I hope life is treating you well I miss you. How tall are you? I am 5'5", five, five, which is not very tall at all. Actually, I'd say I'm like average height for a girl, so I'm not, I'm not really short, but I'm not tall. Dogs are cats, dogs, of course. If you've seen my videos before, I'm looking at my dog right now. <laughs> if you've watched my videos before, then you've seen my dog, Benji. Um, he is one years old, and he's a chihuahua mixed with, they don't know what, but he kind of looks like a wiener dog a little bit. He a little long, he a little longer than a chihuahua, so. Yeah, I don't know. Definitely dogs. I feel like, I'm sorry, if you're a cat person, no offense, but I feel like cats are so sneaky. And I don't even say the rest, but I just feel like they're sneaky and that I don't like. Funniest moment throughout high school. Honestly, there are a lot of funny moments um, that I remember from high school. Hmm. But ones that come to mind. So, um, two of my really close friends now were not my close friends when I first got to high school. So, Anya and Danasia. Hey. Um, so, they were in my honors algebra class. And the very first day, literally the very first day, Naja comes up to me and she's like, you used to date, I won't say their name, so-and-so um, in eighth grade. And I'm like, 
no I didn't like I really didn't I had never had a boyfriend before um so yeah I was like no I didn't like what and I guess she thought I was lying because her that boy's cousin was her best friend and I guess that's like they used to just be like, you guys are cute together, blah, 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 but he was not my boyfriend. But she was basically going back and forth trying to tell me that he outdated him. And I was like, I don't even know you for one. It's the first day of school. You in my face about some boy that you claimed was my boyfriend and he wasn't. Like, stop. And Anya was with her. They're best friends. Anya was with her and she was like laughing. Like, and even now that we're all like best friends, Anya is always the one laughing in the background like whenever me and Asia are going back and forth so I think that's funny because eventually we all end up becoming uh, best friends like I said like they were with me throughout my entire four years of high school I still see them now we communicate like every week like I talk to them very often hang out with them when I come home and everything so I think that's funny and then I later on that day I ended up finding out I had Spanish with them which I was like oh my god like away from me but and they know this like we joke around like we talk about this story all the time but um yeah and like like after that like Danasia would try to like they would like try to sit by me and stuff not like because I, I wasn't popular like I'm not saying like they try to sit by me because I was like not like that but they would try to sit by me or like include me and stuff and I was like nah, 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 I don't want to be I don't want to be but one day me and Danasia got sat by each other and we weren't like friend friends yet and she was asking me we had like clickers and she was like what did you put and i was just like like i was like, like i was trying to pretend like i know the answer but obviously i didn't know because i already clicked my answer in but to this day to this day they make fun of me about i giving her an answer and stuff maybe i should bring them on and we can talk about the time that we met anywho I'm sure you guys will meet them one day. They are very, very, very funny people. And I love them. Okay, what year were you born? 1997. Um, are you in or have you gone to college? I am currently a junior in college at Mizzou. What is your favorite drink? It should be water, but it is probably strawberry lemonade. I love strawberry lemonade. Mm -hmm. I don't know what that was. I can say any type of lemonade. I'm down. Well, pretty much any type of lemonade. Okay. Okay, all right, okay, all right, okay, all right. <laughs> if you guys watch Miranda Sings on YouTube, then you know where I got that from. Back to the question, what is your spirit animal and why? So I think my spirit animal is my favorite animal, which is a horse. And I know most people are like, girl, a horse? You wanna be a horse? But let me tell you, horses are like so majestic and they're beautiful and they're strong and like just running in the wind, living their best life when people aren't holding them captive and riding them on carriages. Guys, please don't do that. That is animal cruelty, okay? People are like, well, that's what they're for. You want somebody riding your back while you strapped up? No, I didn't think so. Back to my questions and don't mind my nail. You're wearing perfume. What scent is it? Hmm, well, recently, I've had three new favorite scents. In the Stars, which is from Bath & Body Works, and then Bloom by Gucci, Crushed by Rihanna. All smell amazing. Thank you to the people that, you know, <laughs> gifted me both. They all know me. Um, tea or coffee? I'm actually both. It's story time. So I always like, like I like, okay, so I will always drink like cups of coffee, hot coffee, and like, like I just love drinking coffee. Like if I was staying up late to study or something, like I would, give me a hot cup of joe but but then i started you know i was realizing like how much sugar and stuff i add to my coffee just to make it taste good to me and i was like uh, i should probably like lay off of this for a little bit like it was like it's just a lot of sugar and creamer and stuff so then i started drinking green tea um probably like 
two, three weeks before, probably two weeks or three possibly before I came home for break and I was just drinking like a lot of green tea. Like I would probably drink two to three cups a day. And then when I came home, you know, me and my mom just love to go to Starbucks together. So normally I would get like a caramel frappe from Starbucks, but um, I'm kind of like off of that a little bit right now. And I just started getting a caramel iced coffee instead, which I know it's not like that different, but so I've recently been drinking caramel iced coffees. Long story short, I could have just said that. Okay, sorry. What sports do you play or have you played? I do not play, well, I dance as of now, but um, I used to cheer, play volleyball, run track, and dance. And I currently just still dance. Have any books you read changed your life? I am currently reading, excuse my French, You Are a Badass and I'm loving it. I, I'm not done with the book, but I really feel like it is going to be like a life changer. It already has like had me thinking and like changing some things um, like in my daily routine. Um, and by that, I mean like within changing myself or, um, you know, just trying to better myself in general. So I would, I feel like this book is life changing and it's been out for so long so many people have read it my mom has read it my brother has read it and i wanted to read it but when it came time for me to want to get into it my mom looked out the book and no one ever gave it back but recently we went to urban outfitters and the book was there and i bought it and i've been loving it thus far loving it so um yeah you are badass what is your favorite movie Y'all wanna know what I love? I love the Fast and Furious series, okay? I know this seems like, girl, what? Really? Really, I love the Fast and Furious series. I also love the Planet of the Apes series. Why? Because I like fast cars, and you know, I love action movies and stuff, so Fast and Furious just give me all of that in one. And it's funny, like they have their funny moments in there too. And then Planet of the Apes, like I love apes, monkeys. I want one. Everybody in my life keeps saying, girl, no. But I don't see why. Okay, I do see why, but I still want one. I still want one. What are your favorite YouTubers? So I like Raven Lee's, I like Aaliyah J. I like um, the Marillo twins. I love how like family oriented they are. Um, Tierra Walker, love her. Uh, yeah, those are just to name a few. Do you speak any languages and how well? I know some Spanish. I took four years of Spanish, AP Spanish in high school and how much of it do I remember? <laughs> Nada. <laughs> Was that corny? Cause I thought I was kinda clever. <laughs> no, um. Yeah, I really don't remember much Spanish. I think that I can understand it more than I can speak it because I can remember certain words and phrases and that just kind of gives me the context to put it together. So yeah. Um, are you single or taken? I am taken. What is your idea of a dream date? Honestly, I kind of feel like the person that you're with can make any date great if you guys just like really like or love each other in that manner and like you guys always have a good time together um yeah how long was your longest relationship well the one that i'm in now because this is my first boyfriend and we are at a year and a half currently how would you describe your fashion sense mm, lazy <laughs> i think i could be a little bit of both but i like sweats sweatshirts like this but like I can also dress it up you know do a whole little 360 on you real quick <laughs> no but um yeah so I think I'm um, mixed with a little bit of chill a little bit of fancy you know I can switch it up I can do both 
Um, how many siblings do you have? I have two brothers, one younger, one older, and I am three years apart from both of them. So we are 18, 21, and 24. Let's see, do you have any bad habits? Bring it in, bring it in, come here. Come here. Hi, my name is Ashley. And I'm addicted to hot flies. <laughs> yes, it's true. <laughs> I just cannot give up hot fries. I can give up everything else except the hot fries. But let me tell you something. I have not had hot fries in my camera stop. But yes, I have not had hot fries in like four days, guys. <laughs> like four days. <laughs> I don't know if I'm gonna make it. Yes, I am. I'm being so dramatic. One of my goals for 2019 is to only eat one bag of hot fries every two weeks. Baby steps. Um, tell us one thing about you that we wouldn't know. Hmm. I don't know. The only thing I can think of right now is that I have three tattoos. Um, I don't know why I just did that. But I have three tattoos and I only say that you wouldn't know that is because they're all like, well two of them are hidden right now. Like on a daily basis you can't really see them. Um, yeah. That's the only thing I can think of right now. That wraps up this get to know me tag. I hope you guys enjoyed it. You learned something new about me. You feel like you know me a tad bit better. Um, there is there is a second part to this. So if you guys would like me to do that, um, leave a comment down below or thumbs up this video to let me know that you want to see um, a part two. Um, or maybe that you just want to see a regular Q&A, which I was kind of thinking about doing later down the line, you know, like maybe when there's more of us. But um, yeah, thumbs up this video. Ow. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you guys want to see from me in 2019. And don't forget to subscribe and I will see you guys later. Bye.